Thank you, John. And I'll thank you again for that right now. Nick stayed. <laughs> All right, then. Let me ask you something, clones. I ask you this hypothetically and rhetorically. Would you rather me just kind of rant on about things? Because I've got other things I can rant on about. Or would you rather me indulge them with that type of thing? I don't care what you think. Let's go to the phones. John in Little Rock. Larry, I'll get to you, but I do have a deal. If you're on hold as Parody Larry, and somebody has a parody about you, Parody Larry, they go first. John in Little Rock. Hey, John, what's up? What's up, Rome? Been a long time. My radio didn't have to show for the last three months. It was like dead for my life. Why? You let John, why, why, why? Why was your radio without the show for three months? I don't know. Like, after we did the parodies for all of that, you know, after Christmas and all of that, it, when I turned back that next week when you came back, it was not on. And I haven't heard it for three months. But this is like my second full day catching the show. <laughs> and I love it. Thanks. Uh, lovely. Your parodies come from under. <laughs> Gorilla Falls, this my like thunder. Your parodies come from under. Gorilla Falls, you better let them go. Yo, I will listen to this for sure one day. And I heard something that Larry had to say. He talked about that and that other guy. But with the story that's got read, I wonder why. Because your parodies come from under the... Come on, balls! They smell like thunder! Your parodies come from under... Come on, balls! You better...